One of the best things that we can possibly do to prepare for menopause uh, is to get our metabolic health under very good control and understand our baseline so we understand how it's changing when we have the estrogen decline that is going to make it harder to be metabolically healthy. And that's the reality. It's the unfortunate reality is that when estrogen declines in menopause, we become less insulin sensitive, basically more metabolically dysfunctional because estrogen is very protective for our insulin sensitivity. There's so much we can do. But step one is like knowing where you're starting. I'm 36 and I will honestly tell you, I'm already preparing for menopause. I am lifting weights. I'm building the muscle now so that I have this incredible glucose sink on my skeleton for when I become potentially a little bit less insulin sensitive. I'm learning how to balance my blood sugar now with you know a continuous glucose monitor so that I know what causes my glucose to go very high because that can be associated with hot flashes and things like that. One of the best things that people can do prior to menopause and as they're entering perimenopause and menopause is to focus on understanding your metabolic health, track it regularly, and then practice evidence-based strategies to control blood sugar and support mitochondrial health.